What's the business, folks? TB back again on behalf of the unapologetic instructors. Uh, sitting up here with two of the new students that came on in, man. We're about to sit up and uh, find these guys' motivation out. See, uh, you know, what's pushing them. What's your name, bro? My name is Travis Porter. Travis Porter. Not the rapper. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What's your name, bro? Uh, Binio. Yeah, you can call me Bini. All right, so we got Travis and Bini right here, man. So uh, what, what brought you on? I guess you're going to start since you're sitting close, bro. What's your motivation, man? What's, what's driving you to do this here? Motivation is, you know what I'm saying, create a better opportunity for myself. You know what I'm saying? I come from a, you know, a small family up in um, Daniel Beach, Florida. You know what I mean? My mother passed away when I was a, a young kid, so I had to get everything on by myself and learn everything by myself. So, you know what I'm saying, create a better life for myself. And I want to, you know... One day, buy me a house, start a family, you know what I mean? So that was my biggest motivation, to come out here and learn, you know what I mean? I want to make a career out of this, too. So, okay. yeah. What about you, Ben? Yeah, my greatest motivation is my friend is working here, so he just motivates me uh, to work here. Uh, he said, you know, like, uh, you making big money, so I just want to uh, that's why I'm here. Yeah. Well, you're definitely gonna make some, some nice <laughs> bread here, man. You just gotta do it right, take your time, you know, and uh, just trust the process. Time and patience, man. That's what it takes. Where you from, bro? Uh, I'm from C4, South Dakota. Okay. Yeah. All the way from South Dakota. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You heard him. South Dakota. <laughs> <laughs> Colder. Colder. Yeah, Colder. Yeah, Colder. yeah, Colder. yeah. Colder. So tell me a little bit about uh, what, what y'all plan on doing. What, what's your next move after you. Uh, you know, got some skin in the game. Well, what's your end game? What you ultimately trying to get to uh, by doing this? Um, hopefully one day I could, um, you know, put the time in, stack up my money, and, you know, buy my own truck. And, you know what I'm saying? And then maybe I could have my own fleet, you know what I mean, of, of trucks and stuff like that. Wow. So that's my end goal right there. Okay. Yeah, sky's the limit as far yeah. as that, I mean, you know. Those mini fleets, that's that's big business nowadays, yeah. man. You know what I mean? Get a couple other guys or yeah. uh, ladies to, to drive for you or whatnot, man. You know, you can make some money in your sleep doing that. Yeah. Pretty soon, you keep doing like that, you won't even have to drive. You ain't <laughs> anybody else driving. Yeah. yeah. What about you, Ben? What, what, what's your yeah, game? Yeah, my game we like, uh, I have to buy my own truck. I try, I work on four copy ghosts. So yeah. that's my end game. Well, that's what it is, man. It seems like these guys got their head on straight, you know, so y'all look for them out there, man. Uh, but, you know, that, that's the business. Y'all heard them. Y'all know the scope. I'm saying that's the motivation, man. Until next time, what's yours? Yes, sir. Uh, peace out. Right, Two fingers, time. like a player. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sir. <laughs> <laughs> Girl. What's the business, folks? Y'all know the scope. Y'all know who it is, man. I'm saying we back up in that factory. Got my guy Farage, yo, man. What's good, bro? How you doing? I with you, baby. Oh, uh, man. You know, I'm trying to stay between the sky and the earth like a bird. Not touching ground nowhere. Just fly. <laughs> yeah, that's what's up. Type shit. That's what's up. You know what I'm saying? But we, uh, we got the unapologetic viewers right here, man. Uh, we about to see, uh, you know, what Farage's motivation is, bro. What, what brought y'all on out here, man? Honestly, been here before. So, I know that the money's here. Uh, so I decided, hey man, let me come on back out here and see what I can do for a little bit. It's pretty much it, get my CDL back, honestly. Because oh, I know once you get that, man, you're good as go anywhere. Yeah, it's like the sky open up out there. Bruh, anything you want to do, as long as you keep that straight, you, you'll you never be without a job. They just put it like that. You got to protect that with your life. Exactly. It's a life changing thing. Oh, definitely. Right. Where you from, bro? Living downtown right now. For those who don't know, Indianapolis, Indiana. Really? Yeah, really? yeah. Now Been there now about eight years. Yeah. But I done lived in uh, Minnesota, Cali, Hawaii. That's <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> you can get extravagant. He's like, Hawaii? I don't, I don't think I've met nobody. I was stationed there four years, man. Oh, okay, so. uh, that's right. Yeah. That's military. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right, all right. So, uh, what you think, like in the future, what will your end game be? What what you gonna what you gonna parlay this into? You got any plans or anything that you're trying to, you know, plant a seed and make it grow uh, with this? 
I got a few thoughts, you know what I mean, uh, that honestly I'm praying about. I don't have to wait till, till God tells me what to do with it. Um, I know what I can do or what I would want to do. Now, what I would want to do, honestly, would be bring my wife out here with me. All right. All right. You know, uh, possibly get our own truck at, at some point in time, maybe our own trailer. Or even lease someone to a you know, decent company like Prime is a, is a very good company to do that with. Uh -huh. um, and let's just ride out here together. You know, we empty nesters now. So it's just me and her. Uh -huh. You know, we can either come out here and make this money. Or uh, the flip side of that would be just get my year in, man, and go back home and do do local. You know uh -huh. what I mean? Just so I can be with her. <laughs> yeah, you know, that's how the PSD program started, actually. Uh, it was drivers that had a significant other on the truck with them and they were just on there so long with them that, you know, uh, they ultimately learned how to do a lot of the stuff. And they built the, the PSD program. Well, that's what I heard. I mean, I, you know, tell me if I'm wrong, I, I think that's, that's pretty much it. I mean, it makes sense. If you're going to have her on the truck, she might as well drive it, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Make that, that money together. Yeah, and then it's all going to the same pot. All going to the same pot. You make a whole bunch of money like that. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah, man. I mean, so that that's that's where I'm at now. I, like I said, I haven't made a decision either or right. because you know, as I told you earlier, mm -hmm. my wife does have a good job. So, you know, if if, if I'm going to pull her away from what I know is already guaranteed into mm -hmm. this, then I want to make sure that the man upstairs is telling me, "Hey, this is what you this is what you need to do." Because you know, in my in my few years that I've been on this earth, uh, sometimes we make our own decisions without seeking. Whatever higher power you you know you look at or you go to, mine is God. So that's why I go to. Mm -hmm. um, without seeking Him first, a lot of times we make uh, the wrong decisions, yeah. and then we can take extra years off of our life yeah. and wasted time. You know what I'm saying? Instead of just going, hey, look. And if He don't give you an answer right right away, wait. Yeah. Wait till you get it. And then when you get it, I'm telling you, you're going to save yourself a whole lot of time yeah. to make a decision on your own and going this way when you should have went that way, but you was impatient. It was like, ah, oh, you ain't answered, so I'm going to go ahead do this anyway. Yeah. Now you're going to waste the 5-10 years of your life when this could have took you 6-7 months. Yeah. So, I'm just trying to fit a square into a circle. Exactly. I don't understand why it won't go. Exactly. It ain't designed to not no shape no way. You know, no shape no off a circle. Put it in. His ways are not like our ways, bro. Yeah, you know, his yeah. thoughts are not like our thoughts. So, yeah. you know what I mean? Never have been, never we been. can't even comprehend it. You know what I'm saying? So, right. that that's why I am. You know, right, right. that's me. No doubt, no doubt. I'll stand, bro. I'll stand. <laughs> yeah, well, that's what it do, man. Uh, so, you know, y'all heard it, man. Y'all see it right here. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm saying, can you put it any better than that? You put it in the hands of the most high, and you know, you make it happen, man. You, know, you see the motivation, man. You know what it is. Till next time, man. What's your two fingers? Like a player. Uh, <laughs> oh, look. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs>